สวัสดีเจ้า Hello and welcome back to another episode of Thai Girl Talk with Mia from Learn to Speak Thai and Lonnie from Tell Thai Heart. <laughs> Tell Thai Heart. Yeah, I know you're a little giggling about this because it's today's subject, right? We're gonna talk about heart. Yes, we are. Okay, at least let's get our listener warming up a little. Heart in Thai is. Jai. Jai. That's right. Jai. That's that's easy word. Have you heard of this? Sometimes people say หัวใจ Yes. Right. หัว it's exactly the same word, same spelling with head. So the head of the heart, if if you put them together, but actually when you use หัวใจ you are referring to the heart, the one is beating. Yeah, the actual heart. Right. Yes. Yeah. So, but sometimes they say, "Oh, my หัวใจ only have you," oh. something like that. Or I feel like I want to eat noodle soup with หัวใจ pig today. You know uh-huh. what I mean? Yeah. So right, okay. you cannot say "jai" like say if you eat noodle soup and you want some organ in it, right? There's some noodle soup sell that. You mm-hmm. will say "sai huo jai duoi." Sai huo jai duoi. Yes. If you talk to the noodle soup lady, means yes. Please add a heart, a real heart. But when you're talking to someone in general, like your coworkers or your your loved one, it's mean like pay a little more attention into what you're doing. Oh, so it's more emphasis. Right. It's like put your heart in it. Say หัวใจด้วย I like that. Yes, and say ใจ put into your heart. It's like ดูแล you know ดูแล right? Take care. Right, right. Right. Say, "Jai" means you pay attention to work, to your special person, to whatever you do. So, if someone pen con say "jai," so that person are really, really um devoted into what they do. I didn't know it could be used that way. So I have the list of the word "jai," and Lani asked to see the list, and I said, "No way." <laughs> I like the surprise. I like when you like. Oh, okay. No acting. Okay. Fine. So, how are we gonna do this? What about if I just say the word in Thai and you guess the meaning? All right. Yeah, let's do that. Jai di. Jai di. Good heart. Yes. Um, good person. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's right. All the answers are correct. Good heart. Good person. Generous and all the good things. If you say someone is j a d right? I mean, this person might be generous, give money to the poor, or taking care of the family, or love animals, or anything with good character. Right, because DJ, right? Isn't oh, that? Oh yes, DJ means DJ means happy. Okay. Yeah, I'm I'm DJ. I'm ah. DJ. And if someone getting married, not only wish, call hi, blah blah blah, mm-hmm. right? Right. You can also say "di jai duoi," "di jai duoi," means okay. happy con- for you. Happy for you, yes. I'm um, congratulate you. So "di jai," ah. Okay. So opposite of "jai di" is not "jai mai di." Okay, I know some <laughs> of you might guess that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Because "jai mai di" it's the not really common use. It's used a lot in the northern of Thailand, but it's mean like you have a concern. You know okay. when you say "jai mai di," yeah. okay, you oh I'm so concerned about my son. You know out on the street on a motorbike, "jai mai di," mm-hmm. worry for him. Okay, the opposite of "jai di" is "jai dam," black heart. Jai dam, black heart. That's right. Oh, you see someone kicking a street dog, and you say, "Gosh, that guy, Jai dam, mak mak." Okay, so I'm, I'm guess you can um guess the meaning of Jai dam because it's opposite of Jai di. Next, Nam Jai. Nam Jai, water heart. Jai ka, water heart, heart water. So Nam Jai mean. Kindness, generosity. Someone who care for other people. So let's say this is an example. Lani, me, nam jai, because she's offered to give me a ride. Okay. Kon me nam jai. If uh, it was raining, it was flood, and you know, and you you go there and help them. So nam jai can be translated to kindness, thoughtful, thoughtful. Yes, uh, generous. Yes, me nam jai to be generous, to be kind. So opposite of me, nam jai is. So you put my in front of it. Oh, okay. My me, 
ไม่มีน้ำใจไม่มีน้ำใจไม่มีน้ำใจ yes you on the bus and you see a pregnant woman you didn't give her your seat so okay. this person is ไม่มีน้ำใจ mm. now if someone is giving her seat yes that person deserve to be called มีน้ำใจ okay so you know you helping out each other you you care okay that's for น้ำใจเห็นใจ to see the same to see the heart right เห็นใจ yeah yes so yes to see the heart means you understand the other people around you I was just gonna say like เข้าใจเข้าใจ is no understanding the other person I understand right let's talk about เข้าใจ then when you look at the word เข้า You know what cow means? Yeah, to enter. To enter, yes. Don't be confused with cow, which is rice. It's a little longer, right? With with the ah sound, cow. That's long, but cow is a little short. Cow, cow, jai. Yes, to enter the heart. I like to think like this. Actually, is to enter the brain. Mean you understand. But mm-hmm. hey, understand with the brain and understand with the heart is different. So cow jai is to understand with the brain, and hen jai is to understand with the heart. Yes, you can put it that way. Now cow jai can also mean yes, the information received in your brain and it's go to your heart and you understand the person, right? Okay, let's say you might cow jai p a s a t h a i for example. Mm-hmm. I don't get it. So difficult. And if someone just has a broken heart, or something happened to the family, someone passed away, and you say, "Oh, you know, I I really feel for you for what happening." เห็นใจ Yes, you say, "Oh, เห็นใจนะเห็นใจนะ You lost your mobile phone, so you see what's going on in their heart, mm-hmm. and you're like, "Oh, I I can feel that." Has more compassion in it. ใช่ค่ะ And you mentioned about g r e e n j a i Right. Actually, it's not on my list. <laughs> But yeah. how do you understand g r e e n j a i Lan? Um. Okay. Let's say I need to go someplace, and I know you have a car, but I don't want to g r e e n j a i I have a g r e e n j a i I don't want to bother you mm-hmm. to give me a ride, even though I know it would be easy. But I don't want to inconvenience you. Right. So that's, that's... actually perfect example. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, so g r e e n j a i Yes, exactly. You feel like you don't want to disturb or bother the other. Thai have a lot of g r e e n j a i We will put the link to read the really, really good article about g r e e n j a i on um, Women Learn Thai website. It's okay. An, it's an excellent article about g r e e n j a i All right. So if I say Lani, my t o n g g r e e n j a i <laughs> you you must not feel g r e e n j a i with me because I would more than happy to help you really. But the Thai will be oh no no g r e e n j a i ka g r e e n j a i They will keep saying that. So you have to be persistent again with Thai about this when they feel g r e e n j a i that they don't want to ask for your help. Let's talk about something sweet with the word j a i w a n j a i w a n j a i w a n j a i Sweetheart. Sweetheart. That's it. Yes. <laughs> well, that was easy. <laughs> right. This one is easy. Oh, this guy. He is my one jai. It's really sweet. It's you know like more that puppy love one jai. Yes. Okay. คนรู้ใจคนรู้ใจ A person knows heart. That's right. คนรู้ใจ Person knows heart means someone that really. Close to your heart, people use to refer to someone like you seeing someone. You don't want to call them fan yet. Oh, and this is what the celebrity like to say. Oh, of course. Yeah. Oh no no no, it's nothing. Just k o n r u j a i Well, k o n r u j a i is not only for romance though. It could mean someone who know you really really well. Could be mm-hmm. friends. Could be co-workers, could be family. k o n r u j a i but most of the time it's referring to someone you sing and you just not really want to announce. You know that oh, we are in relationship. Lani, m e k o n r u j a i m a i Ah, me ka. Okay. <laughs> okay ka. So k o n r u j a i Now let's try. Well, we have j a i d and j a i d a m That's the those two opposites, right? Right. Let's do a few more the opposite. j a i r o n Uh, opposite j a i y e n Hi, ka. Opposite j a i y e n of course. j a i r o n means. Uh, hot temper. Hot temper, yes. Impatient. I am. I can be 
จร้อน because I really want to get things done and I just don't want to wait ใจร้อน opposite of ร้อน is เย็น right ใจเย็น of course the opposite the really calm take it easy ใจเย็นเย็น you might hear this ใจเย็นเย็น a lot actually yeah. it's it's really um good to talk about this let's say this Lani ใจเย็นใจเย็น mean you explain the character of someone that they are ใจเย็น they are easy going uh -huh. but when you double up the word เย็นใจเย็นเย็น you actually tell the other person to calm down so ใจเย็นเย็น it's okay no need to get upset ใจเย็นเย็น okay so it's an opposite all right ใจอ่อนใจอ่อนใจอ่อนอ่อน means soft soft heart soft heart Soft heart, yes. Is that negative? Or? Depends on how you look at it, because it means you you easily give in. This happen a lot when a mother, you know, who has maybe son or a daughter, and they keep like, oh please, mama, I want this, I want that, and you say, okay, my dear. Mm -hmm. So that could be die on too. Okay. So you easily give in to you know whatever request. Okay. So Jai on yes. So opposite of Jai on. Jai Kang. Kang ma ka di ma Jai Kang. Kang mean hard. Um Jai Kang. Hard heart. Yes, that's right. That sounds negative. Yeah, it it does sound negative, but depend on the context. Let's say if you have oh, to make a tough decision and you don't want to spoil your kid, you know that they have box of box of toys. Okay. You don't want to spoil them and give them everything they ask, right? So you have to like Jai Kang, stand your ground. Jai Kang, s e a j a i Broken heart. Yes. Sad heart. Sad heart. Sia means broken. Broken, not working, and it can also mean losing something too. For example, like s i a n g e n just want to look around the casino, but you happen to s i a n g e n s i a j a i Yes, it's unhappy, sorry, sad, and mm -hmm. it could be a sympathy um to someone too. If you want to say s i a j a i Duai, remember we have d i j a i Duai. Right. That's the opposite. s i a j a i Duai. I'm so sorry that someone having an accident. d i j a i Duai. I'm sorry that you engage. <laughs> I mean, oh no! No, 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 no! That was perfect. Oh my god, that's great. No, DJ Doi, you engage. Yes, oh, yes. DJ Doi. <laughs> oh, you like that? Yeah. Jing Jai, Jing Jai. What Jing? What Jing means? Really? Really? Truly? Jing Jai. Sincere. Oh. Ah, Lani, ben kon Jing Jai. Oh, Opposite of Jing Jai is my Jing Jai. Di ma, just put my in front of it. It could work. Okay, my Jing Jai. Oh, this person stab you from behind. My yeah. Jing Jai. p o r Jai. Remember when we interview Hugh Leon? Oops. He using this word p o r p o r mean enough. p o r Jai mean you satisfy. p o r Jai mai. Are you satisfy? So the opposite of p o r Jai. ไม่พอใจ Not satisfied. Yes, I am ไม่พอใจ at all when you forgot my birthday. I am ไม่พอใจ We have a lot of word with the word ใจ If our listener would like to hear more, we can certainly talk about it in some other time. Yeah, we can have a part one and a part two. That's right. It's a lot of the word ใจ I can talk for hours. And actually, if our listeners have a question about a ใจ word, we can answer. It next time, for sure. Yes, let's we we with Lani. j a i d good heart, good person. Ha, opposite of j a i d i j a i d a m j a i d a m c h a i k a c h a i k a j a i d a m black heart, ka. k a o j a i Understand. The opposite of k a o j a i My k a o j a i My k a o j a i n a m j a i Uh, water heart, generous. m e n a m j a i You have a generous heart. c h a i k a Opposite of me, น้ำใจไม่มีน้ำใจใช่ค่ะไม่มีน้ำใจใส่ใจใส่ใจ means you pay attention about some things. You really um devoted. You care. So opposite of okay. ใช่ค่ะไม่ใส่ใจ right. That's an opposite. เห็นใจ to see the heart. So I see into your heart. I can sympathize what's happening with you. ใช่ค่ะดีมาก The opposite is just add my in front of it. My เห็นใจไม่เห็นใจ Yes. หวานใจ Sweetheart. 
hearts. Con ru jai. Um, a person who is close to your heart. That's right. Greng jai. You don't want to inconvenience someone, so you have greng jai. Chai ka. Jai on. A soft heart, easy to give in. Chai ka. Jai keng. Hard heart, stand your ground. Chai ka. You really firm with your decision, right? Jai keng. Jai ron. Uh, hot temper, impatient, hot heart. Chai ka. So the opposite is. Jai yen. Jai yen. And. Jai yen. Jai yen. Jai yen yen means. Calm down. Calm down. Take it easy. Take it easy, bro. Mm, all right. Before we go, I actually have one on my list, which is really, really beautiful. Jai kau, jai rau. Jai kau, jai rau. Together. You say it together. Or you exactly. Say it. You say it together. Jai kau, jai rau. His or her heart, their heart, your heart. Which means you must understand people around you. Understand them because mm. it's happening to someone. You might not feel anything. But if it's happened to you, of course. So you have to understand. If it's happened to you, you will feel the same. So you want to give sympathy. To someone, jai khao jai rao. It's really similar to hen jai. Okay, for example, if someone upset about something, instead of like, what are you upsetting about? That's nothing. Think about if it's happening to you. The same right. situation. You cannot really tell them to just like, don't feel anything. So jai khao jai rao. Think about that. Jai khao jai rao. Okay, it's. I think the idiom in English would be put yourself in someone else's shoes. Ah, jai ka. Exactly correct. Really similar to hen jai. I hope you enjoy this episode. We do really much. Yeah. And please feel free to leave a comment and ask any question and request for jai number two. Jai song. Ha. Jai song. Ah, <laughs> cannot stop now. Song jai. Someone has two heart. Oh. Ah, con song jai mai di na ka. Con lai jai. Lai jai mai, mai di. di. <laughs> okay ka. See you next time. สวัสดีเจ้าสวัสดีค่ะ If you don't want to miss a lesson, please subscribe and click like to this video. I'll see you next time. สวัสดีค่ะ